Alakazam! <laughs> Hello, everybody. Welcome to the Roanoke Public Library DIY at the Library video. This week, we're going to show you how to make your very own Magician's Wand. <gasps> Whoa. Whoa. So if you want to conjure a rabbit out of a hat or do some card tricks or any other fun stuff like that, mm. just wave your wand, point it at whatever, and say the magic words. Abracadabra! Uh -huh. Now, let's start with actually how to make one. This is a relatively simple craft. You really don't need a lot of materials. You just need a straw. You could have gotten from anywhere. Um, of course, many fast food restaurants have them. Mm -hmm. If you've got any at home, of course, that's fine too. You need some tape, uh, preferably masking or duct tape. Painter's tape works well too. Uh, scotch tape probably won't because it's not really colorful. But if you want to try it, you're welcome to. <laughs> and finally, some scissors. And that's really it. So, to start, you take your primary color, the one you want most of the wand to be, and tear out a strip that's about as long as your straw. So, for, for my purposes, I like to actually stick the straw to it. Mm. It makes it a little bit easier to measure. That is nice. That's a good idea. And then you just cut along the bottom end with your scissors. Or you know, if you feel like it, you can just tear it too. That's that totally works. fine. Totally. And then the first step, you take it and you just sort of roll the tape around it. Wow. See? Nice. Super simple. And it's actually kind of fun too, because you can just kind of do this for a bit. Yeah, you know, like you're making some sort of uh, pie or something. Yes! If you get a little Dough. bit of the end, that's quite fine. You can just fold it into the straw. Perfect. You can even use your scissors to kind of just push that in a little bit. Make awesome. sure to get a grown up to help you with that part. Yes, you need to. definitely. And then you mostly are there. Mm -hmm. The only thing we need is another color to add on to the end. Ooh. And so for this, I think I'm going to go with orange. <gasps> Fun. Why not? This isn't a traditional magician's wand, but that's okay. Yeah. You it doesn't have, have to be. Whatever colors you want. It's magic. Exactly. And so we just cut a strip out. Just try to make sure it's not too long because it really needs to look more like a tit than mm. you know, kind of like half the wand. Right, right, right. Though, I mean, if your wand has a really big end, that's perfectly fine. There you go. And then you do basically the same thing. Stick it onto one end so it almost looks like you've got a little flag. Mm-hmm. And then roll it up. This is also, this is just so fun. Mm -hmm. It's just satisfying. Yes. Rolling that up. And there you go. Voila. Yes. You've awesome. Got your own magician's wand ready for all of your magic tricks, ready for all of your performances, or just to wave around the house and have fun. Awesome. Abracadabra. <laughs> and thank you so much for joining us. We'll see you next week at DIY at the library. Yes. Awesome. Bye bye. All right, you know what to do. All right. Abracadabra! Abracadabra.